Black Light here. Today, uh, all day long, we've been posting up about black consciousness. See, it was a uh, Pharaoh's job. I believe Pharaoh. Uh, is the one that's more quick on his feet, quick thinking, thinks on his feet, quicker than uh, Seti. Uh, I've been watching Pharaoh, uh, how he maneuvers He's a quick change artist. All of them quick change artists, though. Polite. Uh, Seti. I know uh, uh, Sarnetta is very popular amongst y'all because he uh, showed y'all on the sidewalks in New York how Satan mistreated us. But uh, that, y'all young cats, you know, that's the only way y'all probably got knowledge, which is good. But when he started giving them debates and found out he can, it was very lucrative, he can make money off of him. He started pitting brothers with different degrees of knowledge against each other. And then somewhere down the line, here comes Pharaoh. And I remember when Born Master Man Allah was kicking some serious deep science. And I think Pharaoh, young Pharaoh, was on the phone listening. He weighed in. And he, he uh, co-signed what Born Master Mount Allah was saying. Because Born Master, Master Mount Allah, he didn't want to debate with him. And I believe it was Nature Boy on the couch. And... Young Pharaoh was on the phone lines. But I never heard him go against what Born Master Mind Allah was saying. Born Master Mind Allah is a scientist. Straight up. Uh, Wesley Muhammad. Is a scientist, you know. Uh, there are many in the nation of Islam are brilliant. So the Jews. And their money system. So that's why I got this book. I went up to a, a so-called Jewish bookstore and obtained this Torah. I've been had it for some while. I've been studying it. And I see that it it's differs in various degrees from the Old Testament, and I found out that these Jews, so-called Jews that read this Torah, they don't co-sign Jesus. You know, they don't co-sign Solomon and David to the degree that, uh, 
they uh, seem like they're supposed to be co-signing, especially David and Solomon. But Moses was they man. Moses was the one that they co-signed. Now, if you young brothers would have listened to some of the words of the Most Honorable Elijah Muhammad, y'all would see why they co-signed Moses over the rest, over Jesus, over... And we know that Je the, the word Jesus never existed. But since everybody know Jesus by being Jesus, we're going to use it. Those who, of you who just tuning in to Black Light Channel, Soul School Channel, we're going to school you. We're going to make you so that you won't fear the cockazoid any more. And give you back your supreme black conscience. You know. And hopefully you won't be misled by the likes of Pharaoh, Polite. I hope Sinetta wake up. He still got a chance to turn his genius in the right direction. And Sarah Sudan said he. I believe that Pharaoh is straight up a, a FBI agent or a CIA agent. Yeah. And all those they're starting these beasts, gossiping back and forth. They agents too. Y'all don't have no real knowledge. Y'all don't even have street knowledge, man. Whoever taught y'all, taught y'all wrong. I remember uh, Pharaoh was talking about when he did his lecture. And this brother... Uh, got escorted out by the police and he was mentioning that the police could have been overtook because he was old. He was around 60 years old. Whoever taught y'all how to fight, y'all say y'all took on, on uh, the martial arts training. Whoever taught y'all about martial arts training, they y'all need to get y'all money back or because you never underestimate anybody. You don't overestimate, you don't underestimate. I don't care how old they are. Until you see them do battle, you don't know what they're coming with. A fighting match, a, when you get pick, have a fight with somebody, it's just like a court case. You don't know how it's going to be ruled. It could be ruled in your favor. It depends on who you fight. Black light. But y'all don't hear me though.